to your audience, students and scholars. Here I am Dr. Amjad Ali. In this video, we will learn Sanal Reid, uh, the revenue from printing money. Dear scholars, so far as we have seen how growth in money supply causes inflation. With inflation as a consequence, one of the main questions arises, what would ever induce a central bank to increase the money supply substantially? Here we examine one answer to this question. Let's start with an indisputable fact. All government spends money. Some of its spending is to buy goods and services such as roads and police and some to provide transfer payment for the poor and elderly, for example. A government can finance its spending in three ways. First, it can raise revenue through taxes such as personal and corporate income taxes. Second, it can borrow from the public by selling government bonds. Third, it can print money. While talking about the standard wage and inflation tax, the revenue raised by the printing of money is called standard wage. The term comes from the seigneury, uh, the French word for the feudal lords in the Middle Ages. The lord had the exclusive right on his manor to coin money. Today, this right belongs to the central government and it is one source of revenue. When the government prints money to finance expenditure, it increases the money supply. The increase in the money supply in turn causes inflation. Printing money to raise revenue is like imposing an inflation tax. At first, it may not be obvious that tax can be uh, or inflation can be viewed as a tax. After all, no one receives a bill for this tax. The government merely prints the money it uh, it needs. Here we have another question: that how pays the inflation tax? The answer to uh, this question is the holder of the money pays the taxes as prices rise the real value of the money in your wallet falls therefore when the government prints new money for its use it makes the old money in the hands of the public less valuable inflation is like a tax on holding money okay the amount of money raised by printing money varies from country to country like in the United K United States, uh, the amount has been small. Central rate has usually accounted for less than three percent of government revenue. In Italy and Greece, uh, central rate has often been more than ten percent of government revenue. Okay, in countries experiencing hyper inflation channel rate is often the government's chief source of revenue indeed uh, the need to print money to finance expenditure is a primary cause of hyper inflation so this is all about the channel rate the revenue from printing money so see you with another video ciao